As eBay pushes back at Carl Icahn's attempts to gain two board seats and have the company spin off its PayPal division, the company recently launched a website dedicated solely to the upcoming annual meeting. Online campaigning for annual meetings, a topic I've been talking about for years, might finally have its day. Here's my frank analysis of the new site. First of all, here's a disclaimer that's actually only a third of the disclaimer that one must click through to access the site. I blogged before my distaste for these click-through disclaimers. wonder how many people decide to scrap even looking at the site due to this unnecessary hoop. And certainly no one's going to read the disclaimer. The homepage basically has all the site's content on it, but you need to scroll to see all the content. There's some media articles, an infographic, and a video. There are three buttons on the toolbar at the top of the homepage, one called Viewpoints, one called investors and one called library, but there's really not much content there. Under the tab called viewpoints, you wouldn't realize that there are multiple what I would call flight letters because there's you have to scroll down to realize that they're there. It'd be much better if they were bolded and linked to at the top. The navigation is poor. In the investors tab, that's simply a small collection of SEC filings, and it doesn't include the additional soliciting material that the company has been filing almost daily for the past two weeks. And under the library tab, there's simply four photographs. Uh, so that's a complete waste of space. One good feature is that one can sign up for alerts as new things come out, and the company is actively using Twitter in its campaign. So I give eBay an A for effort, but maybe a C, C plus for the site's design.